ladies and gentlemen. What's up? This is Mr. LG, and you are listening to The Drive Home with Matt Burton. And welcome. You're listening to The Drive Home with Matt and Taylor. I'm your host, Matt Burton, along with Taylor Cook. Hello, everybody. And we have special, a very good friend of mine and Taylor's mm-hmm. is Splash Jordan, as he goes by, Quinn Cooperwood. Well, Yay! The, government the whole, name. The whole government. The yeah. whole, the whole everything. Put all your there. business out on there. Well, splash, splash. Social security one, two, three. Yeah, I know, right? You know, he has life lock, so he's good. Uh, and then also we have the beautiful Miss A Dub sitting in with us. Uh, she hey, hey, is hey. on air with Streets one zero three three. Mm-hmm, right in, Charlotte. Charlotte. in Charlotte, yeah, in so Charlotte. Cool. So she she she's going to sit in with us, and so she's probably going to tell us how terrible we are after no, all. This. No, <laughs> no, that's no. my little day. It's fine. Oh goodness, we need the truth. You know what? I, yeah, we, yeah, yeah. We need the truth. We need the truth. We need the truth here. <laughs> the real truth about this chair is that I it's didn't. Doing I, I did not. <laughs> April Fool's is over. I didn't switch. I promise. Okay, whatever. I promise. So. Um, <laughs> As you know, today is Woman Crush Wednesday. Is it me? It is today. Taylor is now my Woman Crush Yay! Wednesday. Um, I love when I'm somebody's Woman Crush Wednesday. Yes, so Taylor. <laughs> it makes me feel good. My, uh, I don't have a Woman Crush Wednesday anymore. Oh my gosh, we're going to put that out there. <laughs> Uh, we will talk about it. We're not going to talk about it live. Okay. But, uh, yeah. So Taylor's my woman crush Yay! Wednesday. Yay! See, when in doubt, just make me your dumbest. Yeah. Video. That's fine. Yep. What a great so, woman crush you have. What a woman crush. Stupid news from your local stupid news anchor here, Matt Burton. Yeah. A woman has had her ears and nose surgically removed. Disgusting. In order to look more like a dragon. Because that's normal, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. Now, now let me tell you, folks. I, I. You want to do it, don't you? No. <laughs> you totally do. Uh, well, if I could just trim a little bit off this nose. To be like a dragon? <laughs> uh, yeah, it might be a little bit right there. It says a transgender woman who prefers to be referred as it. Now, this is not us saying. <laughs> this the dragon N- wants she to wants it. to be called it uh-huh. like how un how un um political uh, pl- you know what i'm trying Just, to say yeah i i got it in my head uh, but she said <laughs> she's on a mission to turn into a dragon what's wrong with people the self-proclaimed dragon lady has had its ears and nose surgically removed now i i posted the picture up on the drive home with Man Taylor face. Uh, yeah, no, I saw that. I was like, did I post this? And yeah. then I saw that and I was like, oh was my like, oh, god, Matt's, Matt's doing <laughs> right. It's Matt's um, stupid news. <laughs> At least mine's a little relevant. Yeah, well, no, 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 but I was like, I was like, I have to let everybody see this. No, that's disgusting. And it says it has already has a full face tattoo, a forked tongue, and has her has had teeth pulled and eyes colored. Now the eyes are like dyed green. Mm-hmm. It's it's freaky, but Eva Tiamat Medusa wow. is a transgender woman who is turning herself into a dragon. Uh, mm. she, she was a former banker. I guess she does not doing that gig anymore. Right? I don't want to be a banker. I want to um, be a dragon. She, uh, she is a pre-opt MT, M2F transgender. What does that mean? Male to female. Awkward. You're supposed to know that <laughs> in this pop culture. I'm sorry. I'm I mean, you talk about case. Bruce Jenner every day, <laughs> don't you, Caitlin? <laughs> okay, Jeez. Shushay, I got you. I Jeez. got you. I didn't know that. Uh, yes. <laughs> uh, I want to be a dragon. Right? You want to be a like, dragon? But yeah, like, I'd love to be a dragon. How, yeah, yeah, that's your microphone. But works. how is that healthy sure. to cut your ears off and your nose? Like, how do you smell in here? I don't need to smell in here. No? No, I just... Want to breathe fire and fly through the air? Yeah, but you can't uh, fly. Um, though. You know, you know, for our Facebook, for our Facebook listeners, what what I'm doing is that. Yeah, that, I'm like uh, sitting around uh, like, what is going like, on I'm here? Like, what's no, Matt doing? Because I, you know, because you know, Quinn, I forgot that our station manager Johnny D uh-huh. came in and put a microphone 
for Splash and one for uh, that is right A Dub, and I was like trying to do like. You know, like try to direct, like, hey, there's a microphone for her, and there's one for you. Yeah. So yeah. So there you go. So Facebook, that's what we're doing here. I I I'm here, and I, I didn't know, even what know that's what we were doing. I promise. Was part of it. I, didn't, I, I didn't know what was going on. I thought he was landing the plane. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you're right. Um, she's uh, or it says, I am what I am. I am my own special creation. Yeah, so. you a creation, all right. There you go. This is this is a good one. A man running a marathon in Tennessee made a pit stop for a beer and a burrito. Hey, power to <laughs> my him. kind of power to him. I would do the same thing. Yeah, I would go get pizza. I mean, A-Dub, would you do that for a burrito? I probably would. Yeah, Heck splash. Yeah. I would. Yeah, I would do it for some baby kale and spinach. Baby kale. Yeah, I got a big old bag in a. You would, uh, oh, run, okay. Taylor. Kale no, I would do it for a burrito or pizza. Absolutely, <laughs> especially if I was losing and there's no way that I'm going to win. Heck yeah, I'm going to get. Hey, but have eat, a drink. That, eat that pizza. Yeah. Absolutely, nah. and a beer. Uh, uh, but he stopped at mile twenty. So at least he got a little right, hungry. At least he did, and, you know, at least least he did he, some work, and then he's like, I'm over uh, this. I'm hungry. It's, it's, <laughs> uh, but it said that uh, he actually chugged a beer two miles earlier. And then stopped and got the burrito. But he actually finished the race six hours and six minutes. But that's, like, not bad, though, right? I don't know. I'm not doing it. Is that bad? Six I've never hours. done it. I don't do a race. I, mean. I used to run uh, cross country in high school. That's how long it would take me to finish. Is that right? bad? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of bad for me. So, so the guy... <laughs> I would, but you know what though? Uh, before you get, uh, you know, like I said, I don't know if anybody else is like that, but man, you know what Taco Bell does to you? Yeah, I only want. I, I, mean, I only well, want I mean, to the Taco bathroom. I will speed to the bathroom after some Taco Bell. Uh, yeah, there you go. I speed back to Taco Bell <clears throat> and get more. <laughs> and get more. <laughs> finally, <laughs> finally, we have a stupid news story in America. What? America, you're making us proud today because normally it's know. the Brits and the Swedes know. and the Japan. In, yeah, I don't know. The in, Japanese. In the Japan. <laughs> in the Japan. You know, I, I can't don't know talk. if that's a good thing that we're in this. Oh, world. this one. This one is kind of funny. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, for A Dub and Splash, last week we talked about a woman calling the police because her pizza was wrong. This, today, a woman in a salad bar punched a cop. Yeah. Wow. Oklahoma woman who kept using her bare hands to scoop lettuce from a salad bar <laughs> allegedly punched an off-duty cop in the face after being told to cease her unsanitary behavior. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. That's why I don't like going to Ryan's or um, oh God. Golden Crowd. Even though I love that place, you just think of those snotty little kids. Touching They're everything. too expensive for all that. Mm. I mean, I, I think Golden Crow is expensive. How much is a buffet now at Golden Crow? It's like twenty dollars. Really? Yeah, it's I haven't like been so long. It, I think it's expensive, and I'm only going to eat like two plates, maybe. Exactly. Maybe. Mm. I'm not paying twenty dollars to just have. But the rolls are good, though. Oh yeah, the rolls are. You got to pay twenty and, for the rolls and the ice cream. Mm -hmm. the, roll, the rolls and the ice cream, yes. Yeah. <laughs> can the rest of it even be called food? I know. Yeah. It's just <clears> especially that mac and cheese. I'm like, yo, I still tear it up though. But of yeah, feel, so what are you I complaining guilty. about? I feel guilty. You about eat it. it. <laughs> so you're good. Splash. <laughs> I just I don't know. I, I see the, the the dark side in everything. I mean, yeah. I feel you. Boom, boom, ba -dum, ba -dum, yeah, I just, ba -dum, brought, I just brought the room. Ba -dum, ba -dum. <laughs> just just dad, it did get a little darker in here. <laughs> oh, my job is yeah. done. I told you I want to be a dragon. Dude. Yeah, sure. You, you got the attitude are. of a dragon, probably. Wow. You probably will be. <laughs> That's not a You too can be like it. Yeah, maybe, yeah. I hook, maybe I hook up with it and she can put me on game. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't cut my nose off, though. Why not? I need to trim about two inches off this big thing. <laughs> yeah, but you don't want to cut the whole thing off. I look like the penguin. No, you don't. <laughs> anyway. That's not what a penguin makes. But. All right, we, uh, entertainment. <laughs> Woo! I got and now plans. for your daily Kardashian yes, news. Yes, you know me too well. What, uh, what did they do today? So Black China and Rob Kardashian are engaged. Who? Okay, so mm -hmm. let me give you the rundown here. This is gonna blow your mind. I can't so wait. So Rob Kardashian <laughs> is every okay is the brother of the whole group because you know there's mm. Kim, Chloe, and Courtney, and then there's Rob. Yeah, we're not talking about Jenner side right now because that'll get oh. a little too complicated. Mm -hmm. So we've got Rob Kardashian. Mm -hmm. So Kylie, well, actually, we do have to talk about the Jenner because that's how it connects. Mm. Are you hot? Yes, you okay? I'm having a flight. Kylie Jenner <laughs> is dating Tyga, right? This rapper. Okay, I'll Tyga's <laughs> okay. Good. Tyga's baby mom. Ex, were they married? They were engaged. They were engaged. Uh -huh. Okay, so ex fiance mm. was Black China. Okay, Black China. Yes. 
Tyga and Kylie Jenner are like full on like in a relationship, everything. Okay. Rob Kardashian is now, he was Kylie's half brother, is now engaged to Tyga's ex fiance. Okay. So you're wrapping that around. So really Tyga <laughs> is going to be his son's uncle. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this sounds like straight up West Virginia stuff here. Isn't it crazy? Isn't it crazy? Oh, geez. I am just really, I really want to be that fly on the wall at their holidays because I want to know if it's like awkward or mm. if it's like okay. How would you feel, Quinn? I would feel very offended. If right? I, if I was Tyga, I'd probably like. I'm over it. I'm done. Well, I wouldn't be over it or done. I'd be very upset. Yeah. I'd probably be doing some bad things. Right. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to say what I'll be doing, but man, <laughs> oh man, she would want to see me is all I got to say. Because wouldn't that mm. be messed up? It's very messy is what she's doing. Yeah. I mm. think she, I think she's, I think she's I think very she, low class. And I, mm-hmm. I think she's got, I think she's like plotting something. Yeah, she has an agenda. Who? Oh, yeah. Kim? Black, Black China. China. Black China. Black China. Black China is Black. totally plotting something. Is she's she like, white? Oh. No, she's a black woman from China. <laughs> I didn't know. I mean, I thought maybe I can't she. Stand you. <laughs> I mean, you yeah. never know with those folks. I mean, that is, okay, touche, whatever. Touche. But um, yeah, so that's going on. I just really, I'm really want the black China. I want the new Kardashian series mm-hmm. to start because I have a feeling that they're going to be in it, and I just want to get all of black the gossip. China. Yeah, I just want to know what's mm-hmm. going on. Don't you? I don't think they'll be in it. <laughs> you don't think so? That's I think be they will sh- be. Or they like, got to. You know the the sisters are going to just talk so much junk about it. That's why. Because they're all like livid. Okay. You know well, they haven't congratulated junk. them no, yet either. There's no post. There's no. no nothing. They had a birthday party for Rob a few weeks ago and she wasn't there. Black China wasn't. Black China was not there. And they also had a few. Um, <laughs> and also for Easter, they did a whole big, huge family thing and Tyga was there. But Black China was not. Mm. Poor black China. Poor black China. <laughs> well, Tiger got in first. So. Right? So oh. don't know. And, oh, and another plot twist. <laughs> yeah. Black China's best friend, Amber Rose, is Kanye West's ex girlfriend. That is right. Like, they all have to be, like, saying to each other. Isn't that crazy? I think it's crazy. A lot of Eskimo brothers. Do they live right? in Utah or something? No, <laughs> they live in Calabasas. That's what's so insane. Oh, uh, you. Yeah. But anyway, we'll be right back. You're listening to The Drive Home with Madden Taylor. Tired of running? Can't sleep at night? Are you in fear for your life? You don't deserve this, nor do you have to deal with it. Every nine seconds in the United States, a woman is assaulted or beaten. If you or someone you know is dealing with domestic violence, take action. Call the Domestic Violence Hotline at 1-800-799-7233. It's huge! What's bigger than Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton's ego? Huge! Wait, that's us. That's right, they're going to be huge! (laughs) You're listening to The Drive Home with Matt and Taylor. So we've got a a little game, a little thing we're doing here, mm-hmm. and we're probably going to offend everyone that made the list here. Okay. The name game. Do you know what your name means? Um, you know no, means? I don't. What's, what does your name mean? Well, Matthew means a gift from God. I was about to say we've talked about that before, and it's God's gift to women. You know what? Let me like see what my name is. <laughs> right, I'm about to <laughs> Taylor and me. Yes, yeah, Because so, I really hope that it's something like cute. So. A dub. Uh huh. You like to smile, correct? Yes. Do you like for your man to make you smile? Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. Taylor, you like for your man to make you smile? Yeah. Okay. So the top <laughs> ten, according to poll, the top ten names mm-hmm. of men who always tell a woman to smile. Okay, I can't wait for this one. Yeah, really. <laughs> um. So I mean, but but let me ask you this first. Like, I mean, do you, because uh, I mean, does that sound weird when I look at you and say, smile, no. smile, Taylor? That means you care. Okay. So it's not a freaky thing? No, okay. unless you're like a complete stranger and I don't smile. know you and you need to <laughs> not look at me. <laughs> <laughs> like at the gas station, what's so sad? Smile. Ew. Yeah, that's Turn that frown upside down. See, that's weird. So <laughs> top, top 10 names of men who always tell women to smile. Clint, Seth, Ew. Craig. Ew. Pierce. They sound Brock, like... Brock. Owen. I, I don't James, know if I should say it. Nick. Curtis and Neil. They kind of to our friends out there, if those are your names, you're not freaky at all. <laughs> you're just nice guys. Just, 
<laughs> no, that can't be true. They actually yeah. sound like gym leaders. Right? <laughs> uh, do, you, uh, do, you, uh, do you have a, one of these that made the list? No. Mm. Literally, I've never. Okay. I could picture men that have told me to smile that probably had those names. Okay. Just I mean, looking. you're right. Like yeah. random guys. Yeah, like random guys who like you don't know. I'm like, oh, you probably like a Seth, a yeah. Brock, or yeah, a Brock. Ugh, or a I hate one. that name. What about a Pierce? <laughs> or a Pierce? <laughs> who names their kid Neil anymore? Right. Right. Okay. Oh my gosh, that is true. I uh, don't even know anybody named Neil. Either. Next. I know one person, Neil. Neil. I know. One. He does pro- tell you to smile. He, oh my god. He's probably watching right now. Sorry, Hello, about that, Neil. Neil. <laughs> what up, man? Um, <laughs> the top ten women. Now, do you like to tan, Taylor? Okay, obviously I don't go to the tanning bed because I don't need to. Uh, but I love to lay out in the sun okay. when I'm at the beach. <laughs> I just love the Do you feeling. like to tan? I don't get tan, but I try. Okay. You get burnt though. So I we got t- the the two ladies on the panel right now. <laughs> yeah, one is what? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, a little what? little uh, white. Oh yeah, yeah, fair white, white, uh, yeah, little, olive, white, pale. Okay, okay. And the other one is uh, nicely tanned. There you oh, go. We were Good really one. like segregating the. the no, we were. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, she's nicely no, tanned, and I'm just pale. That's no flesh on a paper but plate. It says that like it's, we have different, we have different skin yeah. tones. Like yeah, we have sure. different. It's like mm-hmm. different types. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, I'm and, trying not uh, to segregate list, against women. <laughs> this list is absolutely di- ridiculous because I was married to one of these on here, and she so, was whiter than bird crap. So it's and, uh, it's the names. The the top ten women who think orange tan looks natural. You know the orange tan. Uh, yeah, but okay. I've never had like Donald that Trump. Mm-hmm. Uh, Patricia, like Donald Trump. <gasps> Patricia, Kelly. Okay, yeah, totally. April, Kelly. which was my ex-wife. Brooke Did, was, was she an orange? ex-girlfriend. No, she was whiter than bird crap. Uh, are, uh, Brooke, I could definitely see. Uh, I know a lot Bro- of Brooke. Well, that are I orange-y. can see Brooke. My 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 former girlfriend Brooke. She yeah, I was, was about not. to say. I, I feel like you dated a Brooke. I did a date a Brooke. Nicole. Awkward. Yeah. Lindsay. Um, Snooky was Nicole, and she was Snooky. totally orange. Yeah, she was all for it. Yeah. Lindsay, Christina, Amber. Amber, totally. Amber's one. I can totally see yeah. Amber. Yeah. Ugh. Tara, T E R A, and Holly. Holly. Yep. Mm-hmm. Holly. Holly. We just named every one of the Playboy playmates. Yeah, really? <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, that's funny. All right, here you go. This is for our ladies here in broadcasting okay. Taylor and A Dub. Top ten woman names who command the highest salaries. Hmm. Well, we know my name's not on there because I am not on that. Susan, one. <laughs> Cynthia. Uh-huh. Well, yeah, because they probably have no lives. Because they're already the executives. Oh, okay. Deborah, mm. wow. Sharon, Diane. I can really see Deborah. Beverly. Oh yeah. Karen, yeah. Judith, Carol, <laughs> Carolyn, and Margaret. Margaret, yeah. totally. Mm-hmm. Good grief. My boss, Margaret. Some of these names. I mean, no no, no offense, everyone, but seriously. <laughs> but that's really funny. I wonder, like, who comes up with that, though? I don't know, yeah, but... I don't know how you determine I, it. Well, well, I was going to do another poll, but my name was on there. So you didn't want We didn't do it. <laughs> Wait, what was it? Just what tell us. It? Top 10 names of men that cheat. <laughs> and I was Whoa. like, no. <laughs> I was like, where's the Taylor one? Where's Taylor? <laughs> Taylors are angels. Uh, yeah. Taylors are angels? <laughs> okay. Yeah, Taylor, Harper. Okay. Um, uh, speaking of some other news today, uh, country legend Merle Haggard passed away. I feel so sad. That I don't know who that is. I, I told him Splash that. doesn't know. I'm gonna. Ad- know. I'm gonna. Dug. I'm gonna admit that Merle Haggard. Because I could have went on like, oh, I'm so sad, but. I legit have no clue who he's, that is. When you think of country, he's one of the country. Like, if I think like, of country like, like, like that, me? I think of like Garth Brooks or something. Yeah, like, I don't. I don't no, even I'm know talking who about is. this is the people Garth Brooks looked up to, like Johnny Cash, George Jones, Merle Haggard, Waylon Jennings. That's that generation. Can you sing us a song of his? No. Mm. Can you I, sing it now? No, I'm not singing. It. Oh. <laughs> Why not? Because we're trying to get <laughs> listeners. Ah, uh, you're right. I'm not to have people <laughs> and drive off another the road. Viewer gone. And there goes a whole lull of everything we just built. They're all bye bye. Yeah. So yeah, but I would really was really I was upset to hear that today. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Not that anybody around so, here cares. So, but how did, he, female, how did he? How did he pass away? Honest. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> how did he pass away? He, he had been having health issues. Okay. And uh, passed away, but but I did say that we needed to. Uh, 
acknowledge, do that. acknowledge that cause yeah. with us being in the music industry and uh mm-hmm. the other stuff we do around here or our thoughts and prayers yeah, goes so out to their family. He, yeah he definitely was somebody that um really made a Different. impact in a lot of lives i'll have to look that up in country music i feel really bad country music but i don't know well mm-hmm. i mean you know it is what it is. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It is what it is. But anyway, we'll be right back. You're listening to The Drive Home with Matt and Taylor. Well, listen, everybody, let me tell you about the rock and roll. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. I love you. Now, back to our show. And we're back. You're listening to The Drive Home with Matt and Taylor. I'm Matt Burton with Miss Taylor Cook. Hi, I didn't have the mic up. She was like, <laughs> like, like, had her microphone like totally out. Yeah, I do want to, I do want to give a shout out to our Facebook viewers yeah. that are on here though, because we've got, we've got Brittany. Hello, Brittany. Jonathan. Hello, Jonathan. Misty. Hello, Misty. Jessica. Any of my friends? <laughs> oh, your friends. Uh, yeah, no, my, my, your friends would be Jonathan. Hello, Jonathan, Jonathan Weaver. Johnny Boy with, oh. uh, and Misty, we all know Johnny and Misty um, ha- Haskins. Misty, yeah. yes, I'm yes. And then my aunt Brittany's on here, and my friend Snook and Allie. Snooky, yeah, well, that's what we call her. Snooky. Her last name's Snook, but her real name's Jessica. So but let me ask you this: I say hi. Now I am a social butterfly, as you know. Since Are I'm, you? Uh, since I know everything of pop no, culture and everything. No, since you started to hang out with me, that's how. <laughs> yeah, real. <laughs> um, but let me ask you this: Is it hard for you to start a conversation with people? With you. With you or just with people in general? Well, well yeah, with me. Oh, no. Oh, no, I'm down. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's in not general. with you. In general. Um, in general, no. I think I try to start the conversation, mm-hmm. but then, like, they don't really, they act like they, it's like some people, they'll act like they don't want to be bothered, and then I'm just like, okay, whatever, this mm-hmm. is a little awkward. But other than that. Quinn, what you think? It's is all it Gucci. Kind of hard for you? <laughs> Um, you ask A Dub. I was trying to get her to talk for a whole hour before, right before you guys came in here. Oh. We and she same. wasn't talking. Uh, <laughs> what? No, I'm just joking. I'm, okay, joking. I'm about to nah, say. We, we was chilling. No, nah, I don't have a problem talking to anybody. Yeah. Yeah. A-Dub. Same here. It comes you easy. really don't. Quinn. I try not to. Well, I mean, you think, but I mean, we're all in broadcasting, so we're asking. We have to talk. Yeah, yeah, we have to. <laughs> Even though if we don't like you, you know, we have to say hello. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, so I'm kidding, true. folks. I'm kidding. He's not. He's I'm, not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so what's 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 kind of the icebreakers? I mean, you got an icebreaker like your line that you say. I don't really. It just depends on like what situation I'm in. Yeah. A joke always breaks the ice. A joke. Yeah. A joke. You always, you know. Um, well, like what kind of joke would you? That say? would turn me away, and I would think that's creepy. Not like, <laughs> a, like a corny joke or like. Something that's funny. Yeah. You okay, know. it has to be a good one then. Right. I mean, how hard is it to have a good joke? Mm. Got to have one funny one. Well, what always. about what what about like uh, when a cow laughs? Does a, does milk come out its nose? No, I see, that no. Would no. Mad. <laughs> that's <laughs> where I walk away. Run that away. Yeah. That wouldn't be a good. If idea. you ate pasta and anti pasta during a meal, would you still be hungry? Mm-hmm. Now I really want pasta. <laughs> you know, I'm, oh, did you see what I cooked the other night? No. Yeah, you would know you, I'm Sicilian. <laughs> What'd you make? Okay. Uh, <laughs> chicken and shrimp, gun and gonzala. Whoa. Mm-hmm. Okay. From scratch. What does that mean? Like straight up. I know what from scratch means. <laughs> uh, whatever. Carry on. Two peanuts walked into a bar. One was salted. <laughs> I don't get it. A-Dub got it. I got it. Did you got it? One was salted. One a was salted. assault, excuse me. Oh, you messed it up. <laughs> I did mess it up. One was assaulted. One oh, was assaulted. <laughs> I right. get it. Bing. That was funny. But don't don't. But if somebody <laughs> random said that to me, I would be like, what is wrong with you? Yeah, I, would, I wouldn't respond I would, to that. No. Uh-uh. Did you get it? Yeah, I got it. Thank you. Mm. you know, but assaulted. does it start a conversation? You just laugh and then you carry on. Right. Yeah. So I'll just laugh at you. Are you then... sure you got it? Yes. Uh, <laughs> assaulted. Sorry. Assaulted. That A was loud. really loud. A little loud. Good one, though. Um, so, uh, you know, you always want to start out with, like, funny questions. Ask a question that'll get a funny response. Like what? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. These are, for, like, surveys. You know, I'm all about some surveys. I mean, I don't know. It's, I'm trying to think. Like, what question? Like, like... Hi, Taylor. Nice to meet you. 
If you were in a circus, what job would you be have? Matt, I would run away. Right. <laughs> I, I mean, it's like questions like that. That's what or, they're saying. Or what about like when you're just sitting there or like like if we're in class, for instance, like I promise you, I probably have told Quinn about somebody many mm. times and I'll be like, God, what is he wearing today? <laughs> <laughs> let, 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 let me tell you this right here. That, and that will be to start the conversation. <laughs> that's, that's a great conversation. Yeah. We will not say a name <laughs> smell that? on here <laughs> because he may be our boss one day. Right. <laughs> well, yeah, we may be asking him for a job. And I know. you know what? Well, you, you know who I'm talking about. Yes, I know who you're talking about, but I'm not going to. Um, you know, he's probably going to be the station general manager one day. Yeah, he's, he's going places. He's going places. Oh, you guys are terrible. <laughs> we are terrible. You guys are heartless. <laughs> uh, so, A-Dub, how you doing? Doing good. What's the worst thing you would say on a date? The worst thing? Uh, so, and I'm not asking you. That's just the kind of thing that they tell you to do. Oh. Who made this list? You yeah. did make this list. I don't like this list. I don't yeah. think it's working. Yeah. Yeah. yeah all right, obviously, all right, they're us. making this list because they try this on right. people and it doesn't and, occupy And they're their hoping time. somebody would comment with exactly. the real stuff. Exactly, and it's right. not happening. Well, all right. What about this right here? Open with a witty introductory one-liner. Right. Okay, course. so like, like the like cheesy that. pickup line? Is that what it is? Well, no, no, no. no. Uh, I'm like, getting ahead. Hey, Dub, hi. My mom said I shouldn't talk to strangers, but you don't look scary. It's not freaky at all, is it? That, that one's weird. That that one's that's what I'm freaky. saying. That one's weird. <laughs> These people are like trying to scare people away. I mean, what is this? The the, the, the list for... If you don't want anybody? Right. Like, to uh, talk to abductors? You? <laughs> you know, to be an abductor? Or assaulted? <laughs> <laughs> that's going to be my <laughs> new joke. Assaulted? Assaulted? Yeah. <laughs> What's another one? <laughs> Excuse me, but I do think it's about time we met. These are stupid. Okay. These are corny. Okay. That, that one will work. That really? one will work. Really? I've heard you say something like that. Probably. <laughs> probably. A, 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 a splash Quinn, is a very deep thinker. Splash, but I call him Quinn. Sorry. Right. Everybody calls he him made, whatever they He want. made this list. I, I probably did. Him. Did you? <laughs> I probably did. I probably don't remember. You know, but I splash did it. Did. It was totally splash. him. Yeah. <laughs> Make a funny ob- observation. See, that's what I do. Like, I'll do what that is too. He that's the best way. Be like, oh my gosh, or I'll be like, hey. Me, you all right, let me let me let me tell you a little bit about this. Me, Taylor, and our other friend Sarge. Uh-huh. Uh huh. We would always we would be like l- little women in the beauty shop. We'd always be like, <laughs> <laughs> no big deal. Sarge would, was the worst. Yeah, so, he was the worst. Sarge would come up behind you and like. <laughs> Make you feel uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. <laughs> like, grope you. <laughs> I mean, not women, only men. I mean, it was No, he just, would come in in my head, like, my ear, and be like, hey, hey, hey what? Hey. What are you doing? Yeah, this personal boundaries. Hey, baby. <laughs> yeah. This personal boundaries. No, but, I uh, interned buddy, with them uh, at Kiss. But he would always do, like, hey, baby, I interned how with them at Kiss, going? and they were just like, oh, my God. Yes, we had a blast, yeah, though. Yeah, oh, my gosh. Yeah, it was yeah. so much Last fun. Last time I seen, he was in a Panther suit. Oh my god, that was a fun day. Is, do people call him Sarge? Yeah, yeah, because he uh, was yeah, in the because he was in the I service. Still, I still call him so, Airborne. I know. Airborne. <laughs> he was in the service, and they call him Sarge. They were like, "We don't know if we should hire him because we're going to feel bad about this dude. Fi- he fought for our country, and we're telling him to go get coffee across the street. Yeah. <laughs> Poke fun at yourself." I do that one. Yeah, no, I've done I, that before. Yeah, I do that one. I'm really not this tall. I'm just sitting on my wallet. <laughs> Uh-huh. That sounds like something I'd say. Yep. Yeah. That's creepy. Because I'm the uh, co-host and producer of The Drive Home with Matt, and, you know, since we're rolling in the dough right now. I can't with you. I can't handle it. Can't carry, even carry handle on. it. Carry, carry on. on. My way. Wait, a that's, a, that's a little joke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, cheesy pickup lines. A-Dub, you ever had somebody give you a cheesy pickup line? Uh, <laughs> probably. <laughs> probably. Probably. Yeah. Yeah. Couldn't even tell you what it was. The Quinn did it early, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, actually did. I had a few, and they all got shot down. So. <laughs> Man, you was thinking you was a... She, she was an... Ir- yeah. What? I can't, what? I, can't, I can't talk. <laughs> I don't even know where that was going. Butterbone milk in your mouth? Huh? I see you got some butterbone milk in your mouth? But, butterbone milk. <laughs> <laughs> this is normal. I'm actually talking good Yeah, today. that is true. <laughs> yeah, we need Harriet Coffee. Harriet. Yeah, Miss Coffee. <laughs> <laughs> a cheesy, a cheesy pick li- a pickup, a pickup line. Do you believe in love at first sight, or should I walk back again? Mm, not the, maybe it's the tone. Try uh, to okay, give a different right, tone. <clears throat> Go ahead. Hey, dude. 
Oh, what? What's up, girl? <laughs> Ew. Did you believe in love at first sight, or should I walk back by again? <laughs> You a Texas Ranger or something? <laughs> right. Like, what was that? Well, how you doing? Do you believe in love for a sight, girl? You sound like my granddaddy. Well, should I walk back by again? You literally sound like my granddaddy. Yeah, no, this is George is Leo your, Anderson. Is your granddaddy Yosemite Sam? It sounds like it sometimes. Sometimes I have You're to be like, repeat that. varmint? What? Okay, he doesn't say varmint. Varmint? <laughs> Quinn. <laughs> what you got for me? Wouldn't we look cute on a wedding cake together? No, that is <laughs> terrible. Don't ever say that to somebody. Mm-mm. That's a bit forward. That is Yeah, forward. That, that's, that's forward, forward. creepy, you, and say, everything. But seriously, I mean, I, I didn't come up with the list. <laughs> y'all, don't, y'all don't judge me. You it's probably the, did, though. I did not. <laughs> I don't see, Taylor, this I don't is see, one I, I don't said see to you. I work cited on this. I was about oh, to say I'm the same pretty thing. sure <laughs> that you did make this I, up. I said this one to Taylor when me and Taylor first met. If you were a booger, I would pick you yeah, first. and I didn't talk to him for a good six months. <laughs> I didn't say that to him. <laughs> if you ever said that to me, <laughs> I would just be so uncomfortable. Yeah, she's a good booger. Ew, Matt. <laughs> she, uh, we did, uh, yeah, so. God, oh, man. Carry on. My way where it's on. Um, <laughs> it, it, like, is talking about a weather bad? I mean, I no. talk about the weather. Like, it's hot. We say it every day. Yeah. That's how we start the show. It's freezing today. But it's always burning up in here. Because I'm here. Hey. Uh-huh. It, is, it, it is muy caliente. Yeah. <laughs> Told you. Mm. We do talk, but I don't think I thought it might be cold because of the ice in my soul. <laughs> Anyways. Um, anyway. Like, even at the grocery store, like. Beautiful day, it isn't even it? Ha- it doesn't even have to be a guy. It can be a girl, too. They'd be like, God. Why is it so hot outside? All right, all right mm-hmm. so this is what the list says, talking about the weather. Beautiful day, isn't it? Can you believe all this rain we've been having? Looks like it's going to snow. I hear they're calling for thunderstorms. Did you just start conversations like that? These are ways to start a conversation. Yes. Those are all terrible. Mm. Terrible. Those yeah. are all terrible. This what, is for people who idea. has no life. Talk about current events. Did you catch the news today? Yeah, no, I don't. Mm. See? It, d- it depends, I guess. Yeah. It depends. If you say, oh, Meek Mill took another L, then that might get a, a certain conversation. Who? <laughs> Enlighten me, please. Meek, Meek Mill is like the king of taking losses. Like, he loses. Yeah. He lo- Like, you know how maybe, Who is like, he? He dates, he's engaged to Nicki Minaj. Are they engaged? Mm-hmm. Mm. Nicki Minaj. She Nicki, has a she's come out in on one. It, she's but, but, Nicki Minaj, yeah. she's the one that says, has the demon in her. She always yes, says about she the, does. Uh, and uh, <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. You're doing good. Hold on a minute. It starts with a J. Mm-mm. What does it start with? Her her alter ego? No, the demon. She said the little boy that lives in her. Um, what? It starts with a D. There's a it? little boy living inside. Yeah, side? that's why. Like, or R. It is it Roman? The, yeah. Roman. Yeah. Yeah. Roman. It's R. It's R. Oh, that's what the his whole middle Roman name is thing James. Is. Or, or, do what? That's what the whole Roman thing is. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that it's the little boy in her, and she like like all of a sudden she was in an interview, and she's like, uh, and starts talking in this voice. I remember that. Yeah, but she's yeah. gotten better though. She's mm-hmm. kind of classied herself up. She a posted bit. a picture <laughs> one time, and she was absolutely like, "Who is this girl?" And it's Nicki Minaj. What does she look like? I'm normal. What a, what, oh, I know she's actually pretty. Mm-hmm. I mean, I don't like all the makeup she's got going on, looking like it, <laughs> Dragon Woman. Sometimes right. yeah. I thought you meant it, the clown. I thought so. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's an idea. All right, everybody, everybody. Yes, I have nailed it. No, 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 no. If I have to dress up like a woman, we when we get a thousand likes, you're going to be Dragon Lady. Okay, I'll do the Dragon Lady, but I'm not dressing up as a clown. Clown. I thought you were going for the clown thing, and I'm not doing that. What's wrong not, with, what's, so you'd rather dress up as a dragon lady than, than a, clown. a clown? Absolutely. But it's, she's it's, got some inner but dragon it, in her. Though. You know, he's the realest clown of them all. Who? And that's why I hate clowns. I'm not doing it. <laughs> Bye. You <laughs> got, you got no. to face your fears uh, one day. You know no. what I'm saying? Like, I've faced them too many times and I'm done. So at a social event. Oh, God. So how do you know Justin? Okay, yeah. Would you say that? Yeah, like at a wedding. So how do you mm-hmm. know the bread? Here I'm, like, I'm here bread. for the free food. I don't want these people. <laughs> you probably are. You probably are. Why don't, we do, Why don't we do that? Why don't we go crash somebody's wedding? And like, yeah, I'm Uncle Jim's son. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm Uncle like Jim's. that movie. That movie's one of my favorites. That wedding crashers. One of <laughs> yeah, it yeah. really is. I, uh, I mean, would you would you crash a wedding? I w- I probably would. If I'm hungry enough, bored enough, 
need that alcohol. Why don't we do that? We should. You know what? This summer, me and Taylor's <laughs> already got some segments. We totally should. We are going to broadcast live, and me and Taylor are going to be Uber drivers in Charlotte. And we're going to, you know, and we're going to not charge the people for driving them wherever they go. We're not? No. Because, 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 because we're going to be like random, like taking them everywhere, yeah. just off the route, just to make them, to see if we can get them mad. Have you, have you not seen that Uber driver who beat the guy up? No, the, the guy who beat the Uber driver up? <laughs> Can't wait to do this. <laughs> um, <laughs> just, just get mad with you. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> But you know what? We really need to go do whatever we just said. What, what were we saying we were Ubering? going to do? No, not Uber and the other one. Wedding, Cra- wedding crash. Wedding cra- no, I would totally crash a wedding. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. That would be hilarious. What to film and us. the su- and wedding season us. is getting ready to be in full swing too. Yes, it's perfect. It's starting like yes. in the next month. But, so but we'll like go so I don't want to go to a little Daniel wedding. Stowe's I want to go to like some everywhere. some like fancy like, like fancy like what's that hotel called down, downtown the Ritz Hilton? Carlton? Oh, the Ritz. Oh yeah, go to one of those weddings. How you doing? I'm, a, I'm, I'm I'm your cousin. Hey, that's my, <laughs> that, that's my but but no but but no one no my luck. I would like go and act crash the wedding and say I'm part of the family and then walk in as all African American <laughs> <laughs> like I was adopted really like, I am. how you doing I'm uh oh hello oh my bad I didn't didn't research on this one <laughs> maybe uh, maybe it's the wrong Uncle Jim <laughs> oh yes yeah, Uncle good, Jim on Mama's side <laughs> the good thing about Instagram though is that you can easily like search mm. any hashtag and you can find everybody's That's wedding true. information you know on what there. talking about Instagram people are dating and finding dates on Instagram oh yeah I believe that's it. not mm-hmm. freaky at all I are you on it. Tinder. Do I? Are you on Tinder? Let's not talk about Tinder. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, 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 we have a podcast up. Uh, we have a segment posted on our page about it. So oh, my God. Check it out. My, uh, I am Broadcast Guy 83. <laughs> that's his Tinder. That's your Tinder name? No, that's not your Tinder no, I'm, name. That's, that's another website name. That's all of them. Is it your Sugar Babies? What? <laughs> what? The site like Sugar Babies. <laughs> Sugar babies. Mm-hmm. No, I'm more of a splendor daddy. Hey. <laughs> oh my gosh. I Wanna be a sugar daddy, but ain't got the funds. <laughs> I can't so you a splendor daddy. Anymore. Hey, ain't you ever heard that splendor daddy? No. You, you wanna be a sugar daddy but ain't got the funds, so you just a splendor daddy. Mm-hmm. A splendor. Obviously this is why he's single. <laughs> <laughs> Love ya. Carry on. <laughs> My broke son. No, I'm kidding. Oh, gosh. <laughs> where, where, where were we? This escalates every week. Every week. Every it day. always escalates. So, um, waiting on someone, when you wait for somebody, like, hey, Dub, do you ever, do you ever, like, get, like today when we were waiting on Taylor to get here? Oh, yeah. Right. We were waiting a while. Must be saying... Looks like we're going to be here a while, huh? Well. That's what you tell people. <laughs> well, yeah, I do. Or, oh, no, no, I'm sorry, waiting somewhere. So so you're at the bus stop. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> the bus must be running late today, huh? <laughs> you think? It depends on what kind of mood I'm in, if that's going to aggravate me. You just if I'm like, just like, if I'm oh. like over it, I'm like, you think? Like, duh. Where is but the freaking like, bus? Yeah, but if I'm nice, I'm like, God, I know, right? I love your dress. Can I ask who, where you got it? I mean, I mean, I mean, mm, I mean not, would you get freaked out bad. at a bus no. stop? If a guy mm-hmm. said that, yes. But if a girl says that, no. Mm-hmm. All, right, all right. Well, let me ask you this. Now, I've said this before to a, a to a lady. Great. Can't wait for this one. <laughs> <laughs> and say, hey, you know what? You have a beautiful dress on. That's not. That, that's well, you're not, not asking bad. where you get, got it. Yeah, you can yeah. say. But, but you can tell a lot of things about a woman where she shops. But the thing, if you want to, the thing that stinks about that though is that mm, some girls think that's creepy. Like if you comment on like if you have no clue who they are and you comment oh, you on like nice what kind of parents they are, you look nice you, today. You you literally like won't know. You look nice today. Thank you. I wasn't talking to you. I was talking about just you know. What well, well, no, you do look nice today. I have a t shirt and leggings on. <laughs> but she makes it look that's great. That's like you know what I'm saying? That's the, the uniform. Appalachian. No, for the for the for the fall. That's like the fall uniform, a t shirt mm-hmm. and leggings. Absolutely, because it's freaking cold outside. But you know what? It's Sometimes really I mean, cold, is it? Sure. I don't it is. think you should for go, April. go out. No, no. 
wait a minute, Taylor. <laughs> Taylor's like giving me the, the stink eye <laughs> over here. Going? Like like to the grocery store uh-huh. and stuff. Because, you know, and, and our, what stuff? Uh, yeah, where are you going? Yeah, I'm backpedaling. I'm trying to let me let, let me backpedal. <laughs> um, think I, like, you know, because I mean, all right, all right, all right. So let's say you go out uh-huh. in leggings, tight leggings, <laughs> or yoga pants. Oh, all the time. And a tight shirt. And a guy checks you out. Can you get mad at him for it? Because you wearing it. You putting it out there. You but he don't got to look. Because you don't have to look. Yeah. What do you mean I don't you, you, no, you can look, but just don't say anything to me. Mm. If it's yeah. going to be vulgar like that. Yeah. Uh-uh. I'm just I, like, I don't know why I was thinking. I guess because of, we're talking about leggings. <laughs> Because sometimes I'm like, you know what, this is... Well, not all girls need to wear leggings, I will say that much. Touche. <laughs> <laughs> I will say that much. But most of the time when I go out in leggings, I have like a big old hoodie on anyway. Yeah. You know, or like a big sweater. You know, you used to wear a lot of leggings a lot. Because I hate jeans. And the clown... Uh, the, um, I call them clown shoes. You know what I'm talking about. No. Chucks. Yeah, I wear chucks. Yeah, you wear chucks like a lot. Yeah, because it, it's so comfortable. I don't and think I, I hate look jeans. Good in chucks. Jeans are so uncomfortable. Jeans are uncomfortable. They're so right. uncomfortable. Right, so, A-Dub, I mean, would you go out in public in yoga pants? I would, yeah. And would you get mad if somebody in line at Publix or wherever and say, hey, how you doing? You look good today. It just depends on how they say it and it's how close they are. Like, you're above, <laughs> how close uh, they are. If like we're in the Wait line to check out and you're like right behind me, breathing down my neck, like, no, pants look good. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'll be like, <laughs> right? I'll be like, no. Absolutely not. What about this, though? A lot of young ladies <laughs> like to wear yoga pants that might say, like, spank me on the back or hello. Okay, so yeah, first, first of all, juicy. first of all, yeah, juicy. First of all yeah. we are not in the early 2000s anymore. <laughs> so if still, I see I, someone with leggings that says baby girl on the butt, yeah. I'm done. I'm over right. it. Or juicy. Juicy was always the funny <laughs> I one. Can't, or, the, or the hand prints. You're right. The yeah. Hand the hand prints was funny. So if you had, I never got, I, got, I had, like, the limited two ones I had basketball or like hoop star on the butt. What? I never had like I should baby I should, girl I should, I should, I should get me it. some that says juicy. <laughs> Matt, I cannot wait. Juicy. When's your birthday? Can I get that for you? <laughs> You're not going to tell me because of that. Nope. I'll find out. Out for a walk. How old's your baby? Now that's freaky. Like how's yeah, your baby? How old is she? You had to say it. Don't be like, how old is your baby? Like how old is she? No, you'd be like, oh, she's so cute. How yeah. old is she? Mm-hmm. That could be fine. Yeah. I don't know who made this list, but they're absolutely. We know you did. There's no work. <laughs> no, there's, there's no links. I'm not there's that. no work cited. I'm not that. There's nothing. English on Club that. English. There they are. It's the Brits. <laughs> oh my gosh! I cannot. Way to go, Brits. <laughs> the English Club made this list. The English Club. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yes. I guess it goes really good over there. I guess. I guess. Yeah. A Dub's gonna use it tonight. I might still want. Yeah, though. she gonna say uh. <laughs> well, you use them all the time, Matt. I so do I really not. Be talking. I do not. It's okay. So Taylor, you're going to be gone tomorrow. Yeah, so I'm going on a retreat tomorrow, so I'll be out of town. I'm going to be so sad that I'm going to miss it, but yes. I have faith that you'll hold down the fort. Are you getting somebody to come in? I am getting someone to come in. Uh, come in. Splash, Yay! Splash is coming. If I would want anybody to take my place, it would definitely be. And uh, maybe don't, a don't young lady may come in. If my nails a, can a, be a, 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 a dub said she may come in and fill in. Woohoo! To mm-hmm. help. I'm gonna miss the party. I'm kind of upset. Maybe I can like. No, there's no way I can do that. Never mind. Yes, you can. What well, is maybe it? I can like FaceTime you guys or something. Or, 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 or you mm-hmm. know what? You can just call in. I'll call in. We can do and it. And I'll just be yeah. like, hey, what's Bam, up? Bam, you're on the air. So I'll call in just to like we'll say hi and check in tomorrow. Yeah. Ch- Matt, is the place <laughs> is the place still there? Is Have you burned, have you burned it, down? it down? You know, because uh, uh, there again. are a couple shows that when Taylor had to be out, <laughs> I brought my buddies in here. And you had me, Johnny D, Bradley, <laughs> Travis... Nito, and we were talking about everything and anything. It, you know, it was like Valentine's Day. We were giving Valentine love advice, <laughs> mm-hmm. and uh, yeah, a lot of people probably lost their Valentines because of our <laughs> thing. But that's probably exactly. What anyway, we're join us tomorrow right here on the storm, and go like, subscribe. We are on iTunes. Um, which is really exciting. We're really exciting. Very exciting. Mm-hmm. And uh, mm-hmm. iHeart, here we come. We are. Uh, w- we need more subscribers. iHeart says we have enough listens. We just need subscribers. We need subscribers. Now. 
and uh, but that's not we're not that far away. But so so iHeart is already been in contact with us, mm-hmm. and other markets too about getting in other markets. So we thank you and we love you for everything that you do for us, listeners, mm-hmm. and uh, thank you for uh, letting us come into your home and um, <laughs> making you a little bit more and stupid on your, today on your phones and <laughs> on, on your, your phones and yeah everything yeah. So anyway, thank you once again to Splash Jordan. Yes. You can find me online. Yeah, fi- yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Shout it out. Else. Shout it out. Of Spit it out. Of course. Hey, I, hey, iHeart, I'm here too. <laughs> <laughs> you can find me online at Splash Short and everything. And uh, that's Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, yada, yada, yada. What's yada, yada? Oh, okay. No, no, just <laughs> it's not right. a new oh, social media. No, no, no. That was a test <laughs> y'all passed. That's something I'm working on. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you're the, you're the, you're the, you're, that's his new platform. Yeah. Yeah. Yada, yada. And the beautiful Miss A Dub, which I call Q Tip. By Why do you mis- call Q-tip? Uh, because all I remember was A and then three letters, and I, I, I did <laughs> so Q-tip. Cool. I, I don't know how I got went from A dub to Q-tip. I don't get that either. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know. Okay, I don't know what that. Uh, is, uh, I think the, they're doing the, like the voice of God stuff. coming <laughs> in the studio. Like, oh, okay, Can I'm you sorry, I didn't so <laughs> But anyway, uh, A dub, go and uh, do a shout out to your social things yeah you can follow me on mainly instagram is a y triple e d u b b and my website is it's a dub.com and she's on snapchat too snapchat but, is worst behavior see it's too difficult i worst, gotta change it come on my worst, worst behavior because my last name's worst name. so i'm barely on snapchat you need to get on you it. need to the filters are really fun mm-hmm. really yeah. Hey, love, Especially the puppy filter. Yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> was, was that oh, the yeah. one where you do Quinn, like this? Quinn had one the other day, and he was like, "Y'all are killing the puppy <laughs> filters because literally everybody does it. Everybody does. My it, new so. favorite's the tiger. And Taylor is. What are you? Oh, at Taylor Cook underscore yeah. everything. And mine is uh, journalist Matt Burton. Oh, journalist. Oh, excuse oh, us. Journalist. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. We got misbehaving and splash, and what are you again? Taylor Cook. <laughs> Taylor Cook underscore. Yeah. She's Simple. the Taylor Cook. Yep. You're right. The real Taylor Cook. The mm-hmm. real Taylor Cook. The real Cook. Taylor Cook yeah. one. Absolutely. <laughs> I should make mine stripper Matt Burton or something. No, just something. don't do that. Because then we won't get noticed by iHeart anymore. Yeah, they'd be like. They'd be like, all right. Well, right. that was fun while it lasted. Yeah. Anyway, once again, thank you for listening. We love you, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks.